Hey everybody, uh, this is Josh from Wild Times. Um, I want to show everybody today, I know I showed you earlier in the video that uh, the Phantom that I'd done, you know, the normal run time with standard battery, it's a Phantom 4, like I stated earlier. Um, basically, I did another video with the battery I had, and that would be this battery, the Multistar 5.2, 5200 milliamp hours. Uh, unfortunately, it uh, didn't work, and the reason being is because it's only 14.8 volts. It did draw a little bit, a tiny bit, off the batteries, but increased flight time two minutes. Um, and plus, the Phantom was uh, it's pretty unstable with it because I had to mount it under the landing gear, which you know I, I don't have the feet on it right now. But you know the, that little bar on the bottom, I mounted it under there, and uh, you know when it landed, it sort of set on the battery too. But anyway, this is my new updated one. Same Phantom. The only thing I've done, as you can see, I did the Cryptek pattern in blue and green, a little bit of black in there. Uh, painted the blades. I can't remember if that was done. Um, but anyway, I, that's the only difference. If if paint adds enough weight to screw it up, then I'm sorry. But uh, I did upgrade to these batteries, which are LIHV batteries, lithium polymer high voltage. Only difference is they're uh, it's 4,600 milliamp hours total. Uh, it's 2300 per battery, got one on each side. They do run at 15.2 volts, so this one should give us some additional time. As you can see, um, I flew yesterday just with, just with one, the standard Phantom battery, but I apparently hit a bug or something because it knocked the paint off. Anyway, it looks pretty cool. I mean, overall, I, I think I did a good job. It was my first time um, painting the Cryptek pattern. Uh, but what we're going to do, we're going to let it hover in here just like we did before and see if we can get some increased flight Okay, time. so I'm ready to fly now. Um, as you can see, I changed the blades on the Phantom, and that was purely because I started to run a moment ago, and I wasn't paying attention. I was just bored messing around with the controller, and next thing you know, the Phantom flew over here and hit this shelf uh, because I was messing with the controller. I, I just, I don't know what happened, but it actually, you can see where it ate the paint off my Rotors actually broke one of them. I think one of these tips are broke. Yeah, that one's slightly, but you barely tell it. Uh, so I didn't want to risk it, so I just put new props on it. Uh, I'll do that mod too. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and lift off now. I'm gonna turn it so it can see this shelf, so it knows where it's at. Don't fly these inside, everybody. This is not the best idea. Anyway, here we go. Okay, it seems to be we got about 27 minutes of flight time, which is amazing. Uh, it doesn't sound like much because you can get about 20, 22 minutes off just of a, a, a Phantom 4 battery in uh, real life, you know, usage out in the outdoors, whatever. But the reason we only got 27 minutes is not because of the added weight. It's because we were actually, you know, as you saw, hovering. Um, it takes a lot of power to sit there and hover. You ha it uses all the vision sensor sensors and everything to try to hold its position, so it actually takes a lot of power. Real-world usage, I expect to see probably 35, 40, even, maybe even 45 minutes. Uh, I'm going to do a, uh, another video of test, uh, we'll just call it DJI flight time test or whatever. Probably a little short video, but um, I, I expect to see a lot more. So thank you all for watching. Uh, if you made it this far, great. If you have any questions on the mod itself, uh, how to do it, what to do, what kind of tools you need, whatever, let me know. Shoot me a comment, send me a message. Uh, you can find uh, any information I, you know, I'll throw out there to you. That's fine. Um, like and subscribe. I really appreciate all this um, and everything you all do. Uh, you know, it, it lets me fund my stupidness in a way <laughs> it doesn't really get much but you know 
it's extra money. It lets me do this stuff. I'll try it out before you do it. That way you don't have to waste money on it. Um, I did waste a little money on some other crappy batteries, but it's whatever. Um, but anyway, like and subscribe. Appreciate you watching. Uh, also like to give a shout out to Kentucky Woodsman. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be into drones right now. Uh, you can find him on YouTube. He's got a lot more videos than me, probably 50, 60, I have no idea, a lot. Um, but you can find him on there. His logo is a little circle with, uh, it's got hiking, camping, fishing, things in it. But anyway, Kentucky Woodsman, appreciate it. Uh, thank you all. Like and subscribe.